Good morning students. How are you all? I am Shweta and welcome to the maths class of standard 3. I am teaching you chapter number 2 that is addition. So in the earlier video we have learned the three ways to add two or more numbers. Okay. Like by breaking one number, by breaking both the number and by counting by chance. Okay. So, in this video, first, what you have to do? You have to write the important facts regarding the addition. Okay? I have written here on the board. You just pause this video and write these facts. I am just clearing one by one that the first fact is addition means putting two or more numbers together. When we use to combine two or more numbers all together, means we are putting two or more numbers all together then that is known as addition. As you can see here I have written two numbers 42 and 10 and at last I am getting the result means the number that is formed by adding these two numbers. Okay so addition means to put two or more numbers all together. Okay. The second fact is the total of two or more numbers is called its sum. As you can see here I have written two numbers. Okay. 42 and 10. Okay. And after that what I have done? I have just added these number as I have given here plus sign. Okay. And plus sign is the symbol of addition. Very good. So, here I have added these two numbers, 42 and 10. How? 2 plus 0, 2 and 4 plus 1, 5. Okay? So, here 52 is what? 52 is the total number that we have got after adding these two numbers. So, this number, the total number that we get after adding two or more numbers is known as sum. As you can see here I have written this is the sum. Okay. Now the third fact is the number which are added together is called addends. Here as you can see the same example. Here I have added two numbers. So what have I written here? The number which are added. Here I have taken two numbers. Okay. So these two numbers are being added. Okay. So these numbers are known as addends. The number that we are adding is known as addends. And the last, the total number that we get after adding two numbers is known as sum. So just pause this video and write these important facts about the addition. Now we will learn to add two or more number, two or more four digit number without carryover. As you can see I have written the heading adding four digit numbers without carryover. Okay, here again I have written a note that always start adding from the smallest place and move on towards the greatest place as you all have already done in the standard 2 to add to perform the addition of three digit number similarly like that in this we also will follow that processor okay so like i have written here two numbers i have taken here three numbers three different numbers 3000 in the column section you can see thousand column here i have written 2000 one hundred, one tens and zero ones. Okay, that is two thousand one hundred and ten. Now here you can see one thousand three hundred twenty four. In this one thousand three hundred two tens and four ones. The last number is. 2445 
in this number 2000 2 is the thousand 400 4 tens and 5 ones okay so in this one stands hundred and thousand which is the smallest place you can see thousand hundred tens and ones written here so which is the smallest place yes ones is the smallest place okay and the largest biggest place thousand is the greatest place okay so what have i written here in the note section always start adding from the smallest means we have to start our addition from the smallest place the smallest place is ones and greatest place is thousand okay now here i have written steps to perform addition okay the first step is first add the ones what we have to do in the first step we have to add these ones these number which is placed at ones position okay so shall we start 0 plus 4 4 plus 5 is equal to 9 very good okay after that second step is next add the tens after that we can see tens position here so now we have to add the numbers which are placed at tens position. Okay. So start adding. 1 plus 2. 3 plus 4. 7. Okay. Now third step is next add the hundreds. Now we have to add the numbers which are placed at hundreds place position okay now start adding 1 plus 3 4 plus 4 8 okay and the last step is finally add the thousand now we have to add the numbers which are placed at thousand position okay 2 plus 1, 3, plus 2, 5. So, this is how we have to perform the addition of 4 digit number without carryover. Okay? You just pause this video, write these notes and steps and this example also. By mistake, Instead of writing steps of perform addition, I have written as in. Okay. So, you just make sure that you will write the correct spelling that is addition. Okay. You will not write this as in. Okay. Now, we will learn how to arrange the numbers vertically to perform the addition. As I have written here, add the numbers. Okay. And after that, I have taken three different number first one is 4223 okay the second number is 21 and the third number is 342 so now we have to arrange these numbers vertically first and then we have to perform the addition how we will do that we will make different columns, thousand, hundred, tens and ones. Okay. Now, by taking first number, 4,223. Okay. Here, 4,000 is written. Okay. So, in the column of thousand, we have to write four. After that, 200, 200, 23, 2 tens, 3 ones, 2 tens, 3 
ones. Okay. Now the second number is twenty one. Okay. So in twenty one, the one number is placed at ones place. Okay. This is placed at ones place and this is placed at tens place. So we will not write this two in the place of thousand because this two is placed at tens place. So we will write this two here, okay? And this one at ones place, okay? Now the third number is three hundred and forty two. As three hundred, this number is of three digit, okay? Two is placed at ones position, four is placed at tens position, and three is placed at hundreds position. So this three we have to write here at hundreds position. Okay. Now this four we have to write at tens position, and this two we have to write at ones position. Okay. After that we will give the sign of addition that is plus. Okay. Now we will do the addition. Three plus one. Four plus two six. Now the second step is we have to add the number that are placed at tens position. So two plus two four plus four eight. Now the third we have to. Third step is we have to add the number which are placed at hundreds position. So as we can see in this number, nothing is placed at hundred and thousand. So we will give zero and zero. Okay. So two plus three is equal to five. And here thousand. Here I have given zero because nothing is placed here at thousand position. Similarly, like that in this number, also we have to give zero here because nothing is placed at thousand place position in this number. So four plus zero, four plus zero, four. Okay. So this is the process to arrange these numbers vertically and then perform the addition okay now you can pause this video and write these things in your maths copy